Let's take a minute to talk about the curvature parameter under your skinning controls in VSP. So I'm going to switch it to a none view. So the surface panels are hidden and we only see these feature lines. So we can really see what's going on with the curves when we adjust these parameters. Again, we're going to focus on the top side curve as we pass through cross section two here. And for starters, let's just work on the before side. So I want to point out that curvature is deactivated for all cross sections by default when you're dealing with skinning. And that's because curvature is one of those parameters that you'll generally not use. You can get the shape that you want using combinations of angle and slew and strength in almost all cases. So curvature is one of those controls that we have given you access to if you really need it, but in most cases you won't. So let's take a look at what happens when we start to adjust some of the angles. Now, as discussed before, positive is toward the center line on the before side and outward from the center line on the after side. And note here that we've already started to automatically calculate what the curvature is that satisfies those conditions. So in this case, the curvature on the after side is a bit negative to pull it back down towards the other cross section, and it's a bit positive to pull it out towards this cross section. But if we set this back to zero, we note that all the curvature goes back to zero because these are rammed straight. If we activate this control, and for now let's only use the before side, we'll give it some positive curvature. Now positive curvature on the before side is basically just changing the magnitude of the curvature vector and forcing it to curve upward and then reloft down and meet the other cross section. Now note that our angle condition of zero is still met, our strength is still met, we're just adjusting the magnitude of the curvature that's defined through that cross section. We can, if we want, give it a different curvature on the other side. So again, a zero angle, positive curvature, and negative curvature has bent it back so that it lost toward the center line. If we set these to be equal to one another, note that the positive curvature is defined on the before and after side through this cross section. If we make it negative, it lofts it so that the curvature is pulled this way. So again, curvature is available to you if you find that you need it, but use it very deliberately and only use it if you really think that you need to, because in most cases, angle, salute, and strength are going to give you what you need.